uh, hi guys this is swami narayan and i've done this particular project towards completion of my android certification and this is my uh, project which is about the mobile cash register and uh, you can see the following buttons the home button the card button the trumbull logo the computers monitors and accessories of the products which are sold by trumbull and uh, initially when you click on cart you can say th there is a toast message saying that no products are added to the cart and so like you can go and add the products and this is a navigation this is my top navigation which will navigate you uh, from computers monitors and accessories suppose say you want to add a particular product you uh, this com you can just go and click on the image here and this computers will show the list of the computers which are available within the stores and monitors will show the list of monitors which are available in the store and accessories will show the list of accessories which are available in the store including their images suppose say i want to add a computer to the cart i just have to click the cart image over here and you will get a toast message saying that items are added to the cart and now if you go and check into the cart you will see uh, that the model which you have selected has been added to the cart and the quantity and the subtotal are being displayed and here the total including the tax for this particular product is being displayed and suppose say i want to change the quantity i can just click on change the quantity and it will change so uh, based on the quantity the subtotal and the total will also vary now i don't want to actually change the quantity so i'm just giving it as one and suppose say i just want to add one more product i can go back to click on add products and say i want to add a wireless mouse i just go click on the cart image in the, of the wireless mouse and it says the item has been added and now you go to cart you will see the, the computer which you have selected and the mouse which has been uh, selected recently and again if i want i can change the quantity for the mouse also and suppose say i just want to remove this particular mouse and uh, i don't want this particular mouse now i can just click on this remove image to just remove that particular product and say i want to check out and just clicking on the check out button and here you have to enter the valid name email and phone number uh, my name is swami so i'm entering swami and i'm entering uh, an email address guys this is not my email address just for the sake of entering i'm entering and this is my uh, this is a phone number uh, sorry not my phone number exactly i'm just entering and i'm selecting the salesman name and i click on purchase the items of purchase and once and again like the, it gives the, this gives the summary of what the, what was the last purchase and uh, with this includes a product list which has a this is a computer the quantity the subtotal total including the tax and suppose i want to build the next particular product i just click on refresh application you get a toast message saying the refreshing application and again if you go and check on cart you say there are no products on the cart so the, this will help in adding the next particular product in building the next particular building product sorry uh, finally i would like to thank edu recover for giving me full support whenever i needed uh, guys without this without you it wouldn't have been possible thank you guys thanks a lot